Here is a sad truth about the scapegoat child, about the black sheep of any type of narcissistic structure. The scapegoat child in a narcissistic family system or any type of narcissistic dynamic is the one that receives the least amount of respect. Parents, siblings, and other relatives will ignore, belittle, and make fun of this child. They will say more negative and rude things to this child than they say positive and uplifting things to them. They get a lot of negativity that they absorb from these other people. When parents mistreat this child, it opens the door for siblings to feel entitled to do the same. And when the siblings continue to mistreat the scapegoat child and the parent enables them, it's like nobody is on their side. They don't feel safe with anybody because it's like everyone is letting them down. No one is standing in to defend them. Everyone is standing in to gang up on them and, and ridicule them. When relatives see parents and siblings mistreating this child, this gives relatives the impression that hurting this child is okay. And when the scapegoat's immediate family doesn't defend them when they are being mistreated, the abuse will continue. The people that were supposed to protect you and defend you and stand up for you are actually They're helping prolong the tirades. They are, con thank you, they are contributing to the abuse because they are not standing up for you. Especially when you were a child. They need, you needed your parents to help you and stick up for you, but they did not do that. Because they told, you would have, if you would have, they would have told you to stay in a child's place. You know what I'm saying? So let's continue. The family will walk all over the scapegoat talking to them disrespectfully and treating them any kind of way. Their family will embarrass and humiliate the scapegoat in front of the rest of the family, relatives, or their friends, and making certain friends feel like it is acceptable to bully the scapegoat, or especially if siblings start to bully the scapegoat child and the their friends starts to bully the scapegoat child as well it's like you know a sibling is supposed to say hey i can do that but you can't but they the sibling won't do that they will allow other people outsiders to bully this child and if the scapegoat reacts to this treatment then they are deemed the villain because the family has no regard for the scapegoat 